from a legal sense, um, journalists make mistakes. Good faith mistakes are not punished uh, by debilitating defamation judgments. Um, it is the dishonest, or to use the, the term of art in the law, the malicious and reckless mistakes. Uh, and Fox settled for any number of reasons. Clearly, the judge was turning against them on some key factual rulings. We, rec we reported on that. Then, as you say, the Times reported, and they were surprised, some of them, by how bad it was in the documents. And then you say, oh, why would you pay $700, $800 million? Well, anyone who's ever seen any court case or been around one knows, sometimes because you think in the end you're going to pay even more than that. And so if they put Tucker on the stand, along with Murdoch, and talked about how, oh, so you guys, this is a whole big hoax. Uh, you're lying about lies. You're lying to your audience. You go back and you yuck it up on your super yacht, and then you go back and lie again. Uh, that might have cost them both with the audience perhaps worse than what they're currently suffering, which we showed the plummeting ratings. Uh, in that spirit, right. Rob, I ask you to watch a little bit of Tucker for your reaction. I'm going to play you uh, what may have been, according um, to the case they ducked, because they paid so much, uh, things that would have gotten them in more trouble if they were all knowing lies, deceit, and then, of course, his other satchel of hate. Take a look. Justin Pearson wasn't white. That's probably how he got into Bowdoin in the first place. Plenty of college freshmen do pretend to be members of the opposite sex. And <laughs> so it's a guy who literally couldn't fix the potholes in South Bend, Indiana, is now the transportation secretary. But he breastfeeds, so it's equity. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, you know, that's him on the air. And maybe that is the way he really feels, but it's hard to tell. From Fox's standpoint, it's all a financial uh, decision. They decide that, you know, is it going to cost us more money to keep him on or is it going to cost us more money to fire him? And that only time will tell. Yeah. Do you think he was a good actor when you look at that giggle, for example? No. No, to, it's to be, you know, the thing about Tucker, if you look at him carefully, not only does he do that high-pitched, maniacal giggle all the time, but when you l watch him listening to any guest, he has the same exact expression. There's never a change. It's always this. <laughs> That's what he does. That's what he does for everybody. So he, his range, as they say, is from A oh, narrow to range. Not quite to be. It's a narrow range. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's funny. Um, you know what's funny about you, Rob? When I talk, even today is like a lot of breaking news, but when I talk to you, I don't know why this is, so I'm just saying it, but I feel less like I'm in an interview when I talk to you. It's well, something that, about your familiar charisma. Go ahead. We're having, a, we're having a conversation. Isn't that better? Yeah, no, it's good. Better. <laughs> yeah. I didn't say it because it was bad. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> all right, let's talk about your range. Because you know, even yes. though we love you, this, yes. is, this is the beat. We have all kinds of people on. You know we ask the hard questions, too, Rob. Yes, yes. I don't know if you're ready, though, because you're, 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 you're beloved by so many, and you're in a lot of environments. I don't know if you're ready. No, I'm ready, and I'm also hated by a lot of people because I Politically, speak Politically, sure. All right, yes. but I didn't mean that way. So here's the question. When you talk about range... Was it realistic casting for you to play Leonardo DiCaprio's father? Um, well, let's put it this way. Let's put it this way. He was supposed to be a Jew. So is it realistic <laughs> casting for him to be cast as my son? We all know I'm okay. a Jew. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> And, you know, all right, so maybe Great he's a answer. little handsome, has a little bit more hair than me. But, you know, come on. 